Welcome. This is the Fortnite test load. As long as I play at least 60 minutes, I am automatically entered to win a GTX 1080. So, let's play for an hour. And no, this is pre-release, uh, like during the alpha. Technically, it's on NDA, but I am not going to be releasing the recording until the 25th, so I am in the clear. Because that is when the NDA lifts. been pretty fun so far. Oh, you're awake! How's your head? Okay? Those stairs are really meant for feet. Just a tip for moving forward. Security system failure. Ignore that. So, introductions. I'm Ray, and we're the commander's support crew. Or at least we would be, if we had a commander. <laughs> and if this drill is any indication, we won't last a second in the storm on our own. Say that again? Not a drill? Uh, well, that certainly explains the monsters. Fun fact, our mission was to prevent the storm from happening, so on to plan B. Plan B. You guys got anything? Anything? Incoming Come on. Distress call. Incoming distress Oh, I think you just found our plan B. Ramirez here. I'm requesting backup. Read you loud and clear. We have survivors in danger. The storm's closing in. Please hold. Do not put me on hold. Let's cut All to right, the chase. This right here have is you going... ever considered fighting the forces of evil? Because we really need a commander, and I think you've got what it takes. Don't listen to him. You're going to be amazing. Ramirez, connecting you to our commander now. Guys, take your positions. Lock. Flip the switch. Whenever you're ready, commander. Okay, Commander. Ramirez is counting on you to get those survivors to safety. Hello? Ray? If you can hear me, now would be a great time to hurry up. Copy that. Weapons and building systems coming online... now. Yeah! Back in action! We got a pack of husks dead ahead. What's our firepower situation? See for yourself. Lead the way, Commander. Yeah, this is the uh, tutorial. harvesting tool to uh, you know different resources in this case this right here is stone and then whenever you destroy a, an item or basically a, 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 a object in the game like for example this rock here you're getting stuck you're getting brick and then you suddenly get two rough ores and whenever you get those two rough ores Basically, that right there is what you get for destroying the pile, and the resources that you get while resources in the pile, um, you also get those.
and uh, the the better the material you use, the better you uh, your structures will be. Like uh, I'll I'll come back to that later. Yeah, this right here is a built wall, so it's not going to. Oh, oh wait. Oh, yeah. Never mind. This wall is not, um, you know, the same as the others. This one you can actually get, you know, wood from if they change that. This is what most of the game is going to be about: harvesting. You don't want to have no uh, material. Whenever something is blocking your path, try destroying it. Use your pickaxe to take care of the minecart. Nice. Couldn't quite get to the. Uh, What's your situation out here, inside. Ramirez? I've been holding down find the a fort, gnome in the game. No often you'll find, as well, far as you know, what has happened in the past, you will find items inside it. I've actually found rare power cells and actually epic power cells at one point. If I remember correctly. But yeah, metal, whenever it's fully, you know, built up, it lasts a very long time. But whenever you want to build floors or ramps, it's better to build with wood because wood will, uh, you know, it's keep the cheapest to make. And uh, doesn't really get attacked very often. So basically, you just gotta learn when to use metal, and when to use wood, and when to use brick. Another thing is that as you're um, searching, Whoa. has it always been this bad, Ramirez? You will, uh, nah, all right, here we go. F1, F2, we'll F3, need to build and our F4. way out of the cave. You can use those, enter or you can scroll while in build mode. And in order to enter build mode, you gotta press Q to cycle between combat and build. Excellent and, building. Uh, you will always start with, you know, wood, but then you just press. Uh, let's see, material, yeah, you right click for material, that's right. Um, so yeah, there's wood, there's stone, and there is metal. Like, you can, as you can see, 190 HP, 280 HP, and 370 HP. So yeah, that, that's uh, 90 more with each one. Uh, and then each of them can be upgraded again. Like, uh, here is a wall, 200 HP. And then you're gonna oh, need a bigger gun. Improve it a yet. much bigger uh, gun. Have to come we can help with that. Um, this right here is we need some crafting chest. materials. Try and smashing up some cars and trees. It used to be that you would actually hear a noise whenever you would get near one of these, and you could move your camera around to better determine where exactly it was. But I guess they realized that you know that would make it too easy. So they made it so it doesn't give out noise anymore, but it still does glow, so sometimes you can see it through a wall. So let's go and get this chest and see what, the, what, we, what we get. Alright, another thing is in this game, you're going to see lots of, um, you know, disposable materials that come your way all the time. Like, for example, Trees are good sources you'll get of wood for building and twine for crafting. And uh, the thing is about these traps. Um, is that, uh, like, once you lay them down, they are there forever. Um, if you put it in, if you use it in a level that you will never come back to, you have lost it forever, that particular trap. Uh, you will get lots of weapons as well, and you can either recycle those as far, I, I'm just going to check and see if I'm right. Uh, in, in, uh, there we go, inventory. Uh, let's see. Oh, uh, yes, they don't allow you to recycle in the, like, in the thing anymore, so that, that's definitely another thing you can definitely always search whenever you run into an item, because you might be able to find some good stuff and, you know, always, always get ammo. 
The great thing about vehicles in this game is that they will give you lots of Cars different things like uh, nuts, and nuts and bolts and, bolts and rusty mechanical, mechanical parts. parts. And as you play, you know, like higher levels, you can actually get better materials. So always go for the uh, cars right, first, but, rem but remember, to craft a gun. cars can have Open an alarm attack. Click on the gun icon, select it, and craft. So whenever you, uh, you know, hit a car, you have a chance of setting off an alarm, and if an alarm goes off, you will have hunters coming at you at that point. Right now, let's see, escape. I inventory. Sun. I drank the seed that you're seeing that. Ramirez, come in! We got company! I've marked the location and of now the fort on your one, map. Let's two, go protect three, those survivors. Are your uh, options for the uh, weapons? Whenever you're not in build mode. Melee weapons are great whenever you are facing, you know, um, huts up really close. But, uh, the best thing to do whenever you are, you know, uh, fighting is to first, you know, try and get some headshots on them before they get too close. And, you know, depending on what class you use, you know, doing different, uh, plans. Like for example, there is a constructive class, which is my personal favorite, who can upgrade the um, fortification several times, plus has what's known as a base in the game. And this base, um, you know, you can actually uh, deploy and it makes your uh, thing stronger. And always remember to search, you know, inside of different things for different objects because, you know, you never know what you're going to do. So what's in there, what you might miss. Alright, here's some ammo. Here's lots of ammo. And uh, you can actually make your own ammo, but it's better to, uh, you know, find it and not have to use resources to build it. Also, there, there's some duct tape and uh, some other stuff. Nuts and bolts are a very important item. They're one of the most, the most basic, you know, um, items for making Hurry up out there, Ramirez! Stuff. From uh, you know, open opening the uh, servers to everybody, and uh, and you can do very good damage very quickly with you know melee weapons, especially with you know like katanas and stuff. You can also get, you know, headshots off and, uh, you know, finish things out quickly. But remember to back off when the shield goes down. Like in the top left, you'll see a no, blue bar, a green bar, You're not that and a What's yellow your status? bar. We can't find the a way out of here, blue bar so is your shield, the green bar is your HP, dead. and the yellow bar Don't is worry, your Adamano. stamina. We're so you can do stuff like sprint no need to and worry. We've got your back. Let's place some traps. To keep husks from getting inside, place traps in front of the door. Alright, F5 accesses, you know, different tracks. Those traps should buy us some time. Let's see how those survivors Just are remember to up. lay these floor traps all, all along the uh, path you expect them to take because um, every time they, they step on it to set it off, it has only so many times that it'll, it'll go off and, you know, um, take them out. And, uh, it, it's great for, you know, whenever you're putting on the floor, but there's also wall traps and, you know, half wall traps to where 
Like I could, you could actually place a trap, uh, you know, um, on this over here. Like this wall, this little wall here. Like you can also edit, you know, make it to where instead of that, it'll be that. Um, and you know, there are different combinations for the wall. And you can make it to where it's just a full on wall. And remember, G is to edit the different, you know, walls and floors and stuff. Uh, here is the arch. And there are just so many different, you know, uh, combinations. You gotta experiment that way you can, you know, learn them all. And then there's the, like, whenever you don't do it right, it shows that. But whenever you do it right, it shows that. And then you can also edit before you even, you know, drop it. And uh, you can't, you know, put it to where it's not touching anything. So in order to rotate it, you press R. And there you go. There's, a, there's another one right there. And the, the thing is, though, even if you make a small one like that, every single time it's going to cost the same amount. Like, for example, uh, let's see. That's going to be 10, and then, you know, you edit it to do that instead, and that's still going to be 10. It's going to be the same amount of material no matter what shape you do. So, uh, switch back to uh, assault rifle and go inside. Remember, whenever you're Ramirez. going through anything, Hang look tight. for We're gonna take care of <laughs> things you can search. Because it'll give you items that you will definitely need later. Also, always look out for the different chests. Ooh, we got a... Uh, Ramirez? Rocket launcher. I'm getting some seriously weird readings here. What's on the other... Nice work. Now, whenever you make those two there, um, what it does is it makes it into a door that you can walk through. Remember to put... Whoa! Re remember to keep track of your action. Was this here the whole button, time? Is this right a now missile or some sort of rocket? E. Some sort of rocket. Actually, wait! It's the best sort of rocket! Commander, there's a satellite on board! If we have a satellite, we can guide Ramirez and the survivors back to our home base! Then let's launch this thing! what's known as blue fuel. It's your objective fuel. You basically use it to do all the different things that your objective wants you to do. So, um, collect it. But remember not to collect too much because if you collect too much, it will, you know, uh, be a waste of time later on, depending on what you're trying to do. Strange. Someone converted this rocket to run on blue glow. Okay, then let's find some blue glow. Explore the rooms near the rocket. There should be some blue glow close by. That's yeah, enough. Now I have enough. Add the blue glow to the rocket. Let's go and see if there's anything down here I want to get. Yeah, that, that's funny, like some items are going to be made out of wood, but then others are going to be made out of metal. These I can understand, but that uh, plastic looking uh, container over there, like this one here. This one doesn't look metal, but it gives you it. So that's kind of odd. Just a quick little note. And now I just deposit the blue glow and uh, Great. there you go. Now Lift get outside off. before you're engulfed in flaming rocket exhaust. Uh, so far, I don't know if this thing going off. We need to keep that rocket me, but, uh, safe until launch. 
Another wave's coming. I need some backup. Don't take any chances, Lenny. I'm on my way. What the hell is that thing? Get out of there! I think I can hold it. And now comes the rest of the combat. I know. Put you down instead of pistol, and that should be good. Fall back! Fall back! We've got more incoming. You need the way to that Rocket Launcher is working this game is that you basically um, have unlimited ammunition, but it has durability. So once you run out of your ability, you're out of luck. And the way that, uh, you know, crafting like all of the heavy weapons is, is that's how they all work, including grenade launchers and rocket launchers. All of them work. Like that. As you can see, every time they activate one of these, you know. Oh, well, they can see. doesn't immediately, you know, trigger because that can, you know, lead to problems. If the, when it's whenever it triggers, the, uh, you know, like, it used this. to be that they landed or stepped on it, like at the edge, like the Got first one would step on it, it would go on. off. But I guess they made it to where, you know, they adjusted the timing for whenever it does go off, so that it gets a little more effective, so you can actually get more used to it. Great job out there. Thanks to that launch, we can now connect to our very own satellite. Let's take a look. I'm sure it's not that bad. Oh, oh wow. That is, oh, that is terrible. I, oh, I stand corrected. Wow. Oh, great. They're in space too. <sighs> Let's deal with that later.